Hey guys, this is Camille and you are probably watching this video because you want to find out how the headache buster method works. And I've had this very successful video about my, the method I discovered, I mean I learned from somebody else about busting your headache uh, with asking a few simple questions and people kept asking me how does it work? Oh my god, I cannot believe it. Can you explain how it works? Um, so I want to tell you how, how I think it works. And, uh, but before I do it, I want to address another issue. Uh, quite um, a few people have asked me, um, or, or actually they said, oh I cannot see the color, or, or they ask how can I actually see the color or the shape of my headache. And for those of us uh, for whom it is obvious, you know, it's obvious, so we are kind of surprised. But let me explain uh, to those of you for whom it, it's not obvious. Well, you determine the shape and the color of your headache like you determine the color and the shape of anything else by looking at it. So you simply look at it. Yeah, I know it's, it's in your headache, but you're not looking with your eyes. You're just putting your attention there and then suddenly you start focusing on it and then you start feeling it and as you feel it you might actually see the color and some of you will not see the color even then but you will definitely feel it so what you need to do you need to think of the association that feeling that I have in the head what color does it remind me of what shape does it remind me of and if you still don't know it doesn't matter as long as you focus on it uh, that will work and so when you focus on it and you don't know the shape or color just make it up just say okay green uh, and then maybe round it doesn't really matter as long as you are really focusing on it and, and thinking about this so now we are coming to actually the explanation how it works so most headaches are actually created by you by your own mind did you know that um, those that are not created by your mind, they're usually due to some illness, which can be um, simple illnesses, uh, fever, um, problems, uh, flus, uh, and so on and so on, or poisoning, malnutrition, or all sorts of things. But even those things, and mo as most illnesses, believe it or not, are also self-inflicted. You create it by the way you think, by your beliefs. Believe it or not, that's, that's um, a, a, almost a fact. It's been researched so uh, widely and deeply uh, that we can assume it's a fact. So the same with headaches. Most of them are created by your own mind, your own brain. So your mind uses your own brain to let you know, hello mate, you're not thinking about uh, the right things. Uh, I'm going to give you headaches so you can kind of wake, you can wake up and, and start thinking straight. So you might be creating your own headache because um, you are stressing too much about something or about lots of things and um, because you are looking for an excuse not to do something and you know headache perfect excuse for not doing something not going somewhere you know it's perfect right so when you focus on that headache you suddenly take your attention from something else and you realize that your headache is not really something uh, oh my god what is it it just a sensation in your mind which can have a color which can have a shape and as you focus on it the brain gets the message that you are aware of the headache like really and then it starts dissolving it together with the mind obviously the mind does it and brain and with the brain together they work as a team basically um, but that doesn't matter so when you focus on it the headache disappears and s funny thing is that most things in life, if you look at them, they disappear. And what do I mean by that? Lots of problems uh, and lots of challenges, when you really start looking at them, they kind of disappear. When we talk about things, when we acknowledge things that are in the space, they disappear. You know, so if there is a, a bit of a weird situation and someone suddenly starts saying, guys, it's a bit of a weird situation, maybe we shouldn't do that, maybe we should do that, suddenly, it disappears from the space and if no, nobody talks about it, people choose to actually ignore it then it kind of hangs around there for a long time and people feeling a little bit uncomfortable and uneasy so it's a similar thing the more you look at things the more they disappear <laughs> and uh, that's how it is with your headache at least in, in, in most cases uh, where actually that method I have um, 
taught you, I have presented to you, uh, worked. So if that method worked for you, that's how it actually it works. So really, it's not me um, removing your headache, as some of you think, but you yourself, you uh, busted your own headache. I only guided you, I facilitated. Uh, the, the whole process and I appreciate the comments from you saying that it's the, the my voice, my facial expression, my smile, the way I say it, the whole thing. I know you know it helps because I've done it a certain way and um, uh, but really it doesn't matter anyone can do it to anyone and, and it will work and obviously some people will do it in a more uh, or in a better way than others uh, so um, I think I'm, I might have a talent um, for that. Um, many people tell me that I have a good talent for talking and uh, bringing them, making them feel calm. So that's the whole secret. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, leave me comments, questions, like the video and subscribe of course if you haven't done it. Uh, and uh, let's uh, keep going and enjoy our lives without any headache. Take care guys, see you in the next video. Bye.